Good morning, my name is Jeremiah with Affordable Mobility Solutions. Today I'm shooting a video of our 2011 Ford Transit. As I say, I got the rear entry conversion. If you want these doors to slide all the way open, simple as this. Same on the driver's side. Now we've got a little wheelchair lift back here. If you want to get it down, right side is down, left side is up. So deploy will take it to the first stage and then down will take it to the second stage. The lift is 30 and a half inches wide, 42 inches deep. So you can get a 42 inch long scooter, a wheelchair on there. Got a Velcro back here. Coming inside the van, 49 and a half inches of height. Inside the van, 54 inches. So if you have a super tall or super wide chair, this will probably not work for you. Got two seats up front, so this is a two seater plus a wheelchair in the back. We got the upgraded Q strength tie downs, very easy to do. Makes locking the wheelchair in place very simple. Got your lap belt there, your shoulder belt there. When it's time to put it back up and away, get your remote back out again. And then to up, up is left. So we go up. Make sure you have your wheels locked when you got a chair on here so it doesn't roll off the back. And then the fourth one, stage four, pulls right back up and in. Works great. It is, it's been used, but it works perfectly. Put the Velcro right back there. You got plenty of cord there. Shut your doors and you're ready to roll. Should you forget, steps are all right there. Pretty easy to do. Quick walk around on this little transit. We put four brand new tires on it. So all tires are brand new with an alignment. It's got tinted windows in the rear. paint looks pretty good a few small you know fading spots little cracks on the on the hood here if you want me to paint that I can probably 350 400 dollars your cost I'm trying to keep the cost down on these got a little bit of little bit of fading I think they had a, a wrap on here or one time or something like that maybe they used it for taxi or I'm not sure but just want you to show you want to show you in our videos I'm trying to show you everything I see I'm trying to be honest and fair as I possibly can if you have any questions or you want to see anything more in detail let me know we put a new windshield in it but you know overall for an 11 year old vehicle it still looks nice certainly not perfect if you're looking for perfect you are looking in the wrong price range if you're looking for a nice fairly decent mile vehicle that'll get you around in a wheelchair this might be the van for you we always show you the van number that way you know I have it right here in my possession this is not some internet scam what we do with that VIN number, we run a free Carfax report with every one of our vehicles. You can see this, this just has two owners, last owned a nice salt rust free Texas, no accidents or damage. As we scroll down, you can see Carfax shows no salvage, junk, rebuilt, fire, flood, hail, or lemon brands on the title. They show no total loss. So this is not a risky rebuilder or a risky salvage vehicle. It's a clean title with no accidents. Carfax shows no structural damage. Airbags have never been deployed. Odometer checks out good, no accidents or damage, and no open recalls. As you scroll down, you can see the vehicle has spent its life in Texas. Like I said, I like buying from the south. Nice salt, rust-free area. Also, no matter who you're buying from, look them up online. Make sure they're a real company within the United States. If you send your money to a scam artist that's overseas, you're never going to see that money again, and the police are not going to help you. So look them up on Google. Make sure they're real. Also, look at their ratings. We've, we've got a 4.8 out of 5 star in our reviews. See all the great things people are saying about us. You know, oftentimes I hear about people complaining they did business with a certain dealership. That dealership did them wrong. Then I go look that, that dealership up online, and they've got 1 and 2 and 3 star ratings. You know, if you want to do business with 1 and 2 and 3 star people, you're going to get 1 and 2 and 3 star vehicles. If you want to do business with a 5 star company and get a 5 star vehicle, give me a call. Also, look us up on eBay. 999 feedback that's 999 transactions we've done 999 people said we did them right zero people said we did them wrong that's why i have that 100 percent feedback rating there okay back to the interior it's got the manual windows manual mirrors one less thing to break one less thing to go wrong it's got the manual seats this is the xl so it's the base package just give you a little look on how the layout from this angle is but I'm a non-smoker. I can smell smoke from a mile away. No signs of any smoke or unusual odors in this van. 
you know the interior is fairly clean I can see some light you know light staining on it just just from use a little bit right there so I'm not trying to paint this as a perfect van but I'm trying to show you it's a very nice van been very well taken care of you know for, for the age this is an air pump we've got the uh, if you ever get a hole in your tire it's a slow gradual leak you plug that into the cigarette lighter there can keep air in your tires that can be a lifesaver I'm gonna put it under the passenger seat there we've got one key with this van if you want us to make additional ones on your dime we can sure do so when I go to turn the van on fires right up all the dummy lights go out so there's no check engine lights on no airbag no ABS none of those current miles 120,052 miles and that blinking that's just doing that through the camera view that's not doing that in real life the camera picks these up somehow some way it's it's strange but that's how it works through the camera we're gonna pop the hood here so you can listen to it run I'll fire it up but on these little transits you gotta open here put the key in twist it there and then you got to pop the hood the actual hood release you turn to the right and hold it and lift with your other hand which I've got to set the phone down to do that but that's how you raise the hood on these all right got the hood popped engine idle smoothest little four-cylinder engine I used to drive one of these for my old job I get 26 27 miles a gallon on the highway they're much better fuel mileage than you know traditional six-cylinder vans so as, as expensive as fuel is right now that's very important as I crawl underneath the van much of the same no signs of any bent metal from an accident no signs of any leaks no signs of any rust from a flood damage or anything like that I tell you what I see a little oil drip right there I'm gonna have my guys address that and look at that that could just be overflow from an old you know they did some gaskets repair or something I'll look at it but we'll make sure that's taken care of but that's why I make these videos I double check everything but I can assure you I'll run this back to my warehouse we'll get that addressed if it is if it is an actual leak if it's just run off then we'll get it cleaned up uh, check out my competition look under their vans do they even do they even show you pictures of the undercarriage to show they're not all rusted out got our spare tire there as well but you know pretty clean van like I said Tex got a little bit of surface rust but that's the number one mistake people make when buying used vehicles they assume things they assume because it looks nice in pictures or just because the salesman was nice to them they assume it runs and drives good they assume it's not all rusted out like I said my competition seats go look at their websites they do not show the undercarriage they do not show you a video of a test drive they do not show you their reputation online so th those are the things you need to know if you're gonna send money to somebody you've never met on the internet you need a detailed video you need a Carfax report you need to look them up online and make sure they're real and see what people are saying about them and you need a warranty we give a free 90-day warranty with this van you know surely you're not just gonna buy as is from somebody you've never met before on a van you've never driven so demand those four things you know, and if you don't you're just asking for trouble so let's get it out for a test drive okay the final portion of the video I always like to get the vehicles out on the highway give them some gas so you can hear the engine run feel the transmission shift through all the gears and you know whether you take advantage of our free shipping in the lower 48 states or if you come in and drive this transit home we've done our due diligence we've made sure it's roadworthy steering wheel is nice and straight after our alignment tires all that good stuff vehicle runs and drives very nice it has a very clean Carfax report and if you'd like to talk to me about extended warranties that go longer longer than the 90 days they're very affordable talk to me about how you can protect your investment long term and also keep in mind we don't have any hidden fees our competition is going to feed you a real nice price online but hey they don't have free shipping then they have got hidden fees they got a $500 dock fees tag fees administrative fees all these fees and when you factor in these hidden fees when you factor in shipping next thing you know that real nice price you saw is about three or four thousand dollars more than you're expecting so keep that in mind don't get hustled they've been doing that to people for years don't be one of them and my question to you if someone's not telling you the real price if they've got all these hidden fees what else are they hiding are they hiding a salvage title are they hiding flood damage are they hiding mechanical issues you know I don't know I just know if people aren't being transparent from the start there's a really good chance there's other things they're hiding so keep that in mind and if you'd like to give us a call 316-262 vans that's 316-262-8267 my name is jeremiah if you're more of a text messenger shoot me a text 316-518-4377 my name is jeremiah i am the owner you now have my cell phone 
I challenge you to call the competition and ask them if you can have the owner's cell phone number. They'll probably laugh at you, especially if they're one of those big companies. So you've got my number if you need me. I'm committed to customer service. You can reach out to me anytime. Are they committed to customer service like we are? Call them and find out. Uh, yes, we do have financing available. Even uh, give it, we can give you an application to your phone or email address. And if you're old school, computers aren't your thing, pick up the phone, give me a call. We're happy to take one application over the phone. Nice hard brake, no grinding, no squeaking, no unusual brake noise or vibration. So once again, exactly what we're looking for. And yes, we do take trade-ins. Even if you're across the country, whether it be a standard vehicle or a mobility vehicle, call me. I can explain how that works. And if you do want to call the competition, you want to talk to a used car salesman who's probably going to call you five times a day asking if you're ready to make a deal, you go right on ahead and do that. If you want to give me a call, absolutely zero pressure sales. I'll just give you what information I know. I'll help how I can. But I promise you, I'm going to sell this van whether you buy it or not. So absolutely zero pressure sales. I'm just here to help. And if you'd like to see our website with detailed videos just like this of every one of our vans, free Carfax reports and dozens of pictures check out our website 24 hours a day at www.mobility316.com that's mobility316.com and as always thank you so much for checking out affordable mobility solutions where mobility is affordable call us today